Hey everybody. Hey family and friends, welcome. We are in the car. We are in the car, you know what that means, right? Mm -hmm. We are on an ambitious adventure today. Vigorous, ambitious adventure. Yeah, so you <laughs> if probably... If we get to do it all, it'll be If vigorous. we get to do it all, absolutely. You'll see from the title what we're doing, but um, yeah, we're excited to do this. It's so going to be something very different for us. come along with us, join us, and let's have a little bit of fun. Yep. Because our adventure is going to go right now and get it started. All right. Coming into the Wilderness Lodge. So we are at the Wilderness Lodge. Gary has parked the car. And I'm going to meet him at the top of the steps up here at the entrance. So yeah we're gonna go to the geyser point we're hoping to get in for lunch today they don't take reservations but you can join the walk-up list or you can mobile order uh, through the my disney experience app and you could uh, get it from their to-go window whichever you want to do we're gonna try to get a seat but we're also going to show you this incredible hotel This is like my favorite doors to walk through around here. So I see something magical inside once you get through these other doors. And there it is. Holy cow, guys. That's so huge. Oh my gosh. It's so amazing. Well, here we are. Here we are. <laughs> We're in the Wilderness Lodge lobby. The Wilderness Lodge, look gorgeous. At, look at that amazing tree. It is huge. It is huge. And then we've seen it before, but it's still just... It's just new every time you walk in. It's new every time, yeah. Every time yeah. it's brand new. So let's explain what we're doing today a little bit. Um, this is the plan. We're, <laughs> we're, here, right? we're here at the Wilderness Lodge. We're gonna try to have lunch at Geyser Point, try one of their bison burgers, um, then check out the lobby of this hotel and the decorations. Mm. I'd like to get, well, you can't see it, but I would like to get up there, way up there, so that we can have a view of the tree from way up there. Anywho, um, after that, we're going to get on a boat, go over to the Magic Kingdom, then get on the monorail and take the resort monorail to Contemporary Resort, the Polynesian Resort, and also the Grand Floridian and check out their trees and decorations and gingerbread houses so and we're stuff like that. We're resort hopping Christmas trees. Yep, yep. <laughs> and if that isn't enough, we're going to see if we can't get in over at the uh, Riviera and check that hotel uh, lobby and out. After that, maybe the Grand Tordino. Uh, Grand Destino Tower. Yeah. Yeah. So. Oh, there used to be the Coronado Springs. It still is. Still is. Yeah, it's part of it. Yep. 
And uh, so... Because we've never been to those two, the Rivera. No, they're, and, uh, they're new to us, and, so we've yeah. never been to them. But yeah, that's going to be a, a fun day. So we're, in, we're inviting you to come along with us. We're excited. Yeah. So join us as we take this trip around the parks. Yep. Guys, this lobby is just so amazing. It's based on the Pacific Northwest hotels, the great hotels of the Pacific Northwest. And even the wood that they used to build this was brought in from there. Completely amazing. Um, I don't know where the elevator is, to be honest with you, but I'm sure we can find one somewhere. So amazing, so amazing. Woo. Elevators are over here. Okay. This is the fourth floor. like sit here and uh, watch people from up on high uh, they got the fireplace going which they always do but mind you it is 82 degrees outside But this is Florida. But you kind of forget about that when you're in here. This is so cool. got to tell you it's just this place is so amazing to me there's so much detail nothing they left behind it's just it's just it's just amazing i think this is just so amazing to look at it's, it's amazing i can sit up here all day uh, you know have a coffee sit in those chairs over there and by the fireplace yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> it's pretty cool it's amazing guys it really is it's only it, Disney can do this, you know. Yeah. yeah. I don't have this talent. They got the Imagineers just blow my mind at what they do. They do. They really do. I smell barbecue. <laughs> It is warm by this fireplace, which probably explains why nobody is sitting next to it. It is really, really warm. <laughs> but, uh, this view would never get old, never get old. It's so gorgeous.
morning. Afternoon. Good, how are you? So this runs under the bridge, sorry, and out through there, and it goes down to the waterfall in the pool. So I tried to order this margarita flight at Geyser Point, but they're out of them. In fact, they're out of all of them. Can you? They're out of turkey. <laughs> and so, no turkey. And um, what was the other thing he said? No frozen drinks. No frozen drinks. But we did order, we did order this cheesy barbecue brisket and we are going to order the bison cheeseburger because they are not out of that yet. <laughs> All right, thank you. Okay. And so we're before that brisket comes out. Okay. Okay. This is the iced tea. What is it? It's a... Like the Northwest iced tea or something like that. Yeah, yeah it's good. Is it alcoholic, sir? Oh, yeah, it's alcoholic. It's got alcohol in it. Yeah. What's it taste like? <coughs> kind of like a. Kind of like an iced tea with alcohol in it. I'll try it. Yeah, I'll try it. Yeah. You, right. And uh, and the lemon. A, and I believe it has coke in it too. Just a little splash of coke to give it the color. Okay. I wasn't drinking it off the top before I was drinking it off oh. the bottom. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. All right. So we got our appetizer. This it's is like chili. Barbecue brisket with chips. It smells good. It does. It's a good thing we got the fries with the burger because otherwise we would have got these. How is it? It's good. Is it good? It's like a sweet barbecue sauce. Oh, really? It's really good. It's really good. You highly recommend? Huh? You highly recommend? Oh, yeah. Got a lot of it, so it's definitely an appetizer. Yeah. Water for you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Wow. So it's cool they cut it for us yeah. in half. I'll tell you, this this was really good. I enjoyed this a lot. I could make a meal out of it, really. But my iced tea has disappeared. <laughs> Ready to try the bison burger? I'm gonna try the bison burger. Show me the inside. Oh well. So it has lettuce, tomato. Oh, that's the inside. Onion straws, bacon, cheese. 
and they cut it in half for us because they knew where we were splitting at. It's a big mouthful. <laughs> sauces they use just adds a kick to it or two. It's really, really good. Really, really good. Okay. I would have it again. Yeah, yeah. me too. Nice I really day, liked it. Yeah. I really liked it. So we just saw we just saw the geyser erupt. That geyser goes off just before every hour. So like it's it's just a few minutes before two o'clock and it's everyone used to say it goes off every hour and it does, but it's before the hour. So you gotta be out there like at five minutes too and then you'll see it start bubbling up and then then erupt and we had a good geyser view from in here in the restaurant so it was a good meal i enjoyed that i like bison burger is my new thing <laughs> it's better than a burger burger did you enjoy it did you enjoy the bison burger it's really good, really isn't good. it? Yeah. Juicy, flavorful, filling. Even the half burger was really good. Compared to the, the deluxe burger that we had at Disney Springs, there's no comparison. Oh. It's night and day difference, oh, yeah. isn't it? That was awful. I can't even compare the two. We also had the, the appetizer with the with the um, cheese um, brisket and the homemade chips. That was outstanding. I, that could be a meal in itself, but it was for one person because it was an appetizer, it was small. But it was definitely good. We enjoyed it. We'll be back. We'll come back. This is definitely, so far, I think, the best burger on property that we've ever had. The best place to yeah, you've had even Penelope's in Estes Park. Yeah, you know, Penelope's in Estes Park has bison burgers. They're good, but they're not good as this one. And I say that because it could be the condiments on the burger uh, that made this one better than Penelope's. The Penelope's is just basic mayonnaise and mustard. Here they had. AOA and some kind of sauce, some kind of cranberry sauce or red sauce. Or it was really good. Something on it was, really it was outstanding good. in left field. Trust me. Great, 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 great burger. I recommend it. Me too. So, next on our. What's that? Yeah. It's, and I know they've cut down on size everywhere you go to eat. 
but it's not your normal burger size, but it's not a slider size. It's somewhere in between. It does have a good thickness, though. <laughs> the pat, the patty, the yeah, yeah, the patty was thick. Yeah, yeah. I'm not talking about that, but I'm just talking about the size of the burger. Yeah. Uh, the thing, well, yeah, it was a quarter pound burger. You know, um, it was really good. It was good. Um, so, yeah. You ever at the old geezer? <laughs> at Geyser Point here at, at the Wilderness Club. Come out and relax. It's really very relaxing out here. It's like an open portico. It's, it's really, really nice. Nice soft breeze coming through. I mean, it's a hot day, hot and humid, but inside here is very relaxing. So, yeah. It's a great place to enjoy relaxing, you know, if you come from the park. I want the late lunch and I'm relaxed. It's a great place to do it. So our next stop on this little trip is going to be uh, Magic Kingdom. We're going to take the boat to Magic Kingdom and then get on the monorail there and do the monorail uh, resort crawl to look at their, their Christmas decorations, their trees and their and um, the gingerbread houses stuff like that so that's next maybe that way to spas and geyser All quiet at the geyser now. Yeah, that's the one that was going off a little bit ago. So it goes off just before the top of the hour, like at 57 minutes. Now it doesn't look like the Pacific Northwest. Over here, it looks rather swampy. It looks rather swampy. <laughs> it is. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Florida now. <laughs> and not uh, yeah. the yeah, Northwest. It looks really comfortable spot. It looks like Florida. Yeah. All right, there's a few people waiting for the boat. But uh, we'll get on there and have a little boat ride. Maybe in the front. Just go all the way towards the back of the boat for me if I look as much as possible.
pretty cool. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I'm enjoying you know, it. Over the years, I remember seeing all of these. I often wondered where yeah. it came from. You know? Yeah. Now we know. Now we've done it. It's pretty awesome. Wow, this is pretty wild. Uh, we're so close. <laughs> yeah. Got the Mickey and Minnie topiaries for Christmas. So pretty. You're fine. Guys, we're at the Magic Kingdom monorail station waiting for the monorail to take us over to Contemporary Resort and then we're going to check and see what they got over there. So this is the Contemporary Resort's gingerbread sculpture. It's the 50th anniversary castle and it has kind of a small world vibe behind it with the Mary Blair style buildings. You can also buy, you can also buy a gingerbread contemporary building that you can put together. So it's pretty cool. It's very nicely done. They have the Instagram wall, Disney Disney World 50. So, they don't actually have a Christmas tree in the lobby. It's outside. So it's too hot out there right now. We're not gonna probably do that.
This is their tree. They used to have it over in the center till they built that new centerpiece. Now it's over here in the corner. Still pretty though. So pretty. It's a pretty tree. All the decorations here are really nice. Look at the poinsettias. Would you like one of those kind of hand things? Yeah, so those help keep it balanced, keep it from shaking Did you so much. Like that? At some point, yeah. <laughs> good. It looks yummy. It looks so good. Oh my gosh. Barstow pineapple is incredible. Yeah. I just want to dive in and eat your way out. This one has a shot of rum in it. So I got a straw. Still has the pineapple juice. Oh my goodness. Yum. The pineapple juice is so good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Worth the wait. It wasn't too long of a wait, but it was a wait, maybe 15 minutes. Mm. Oh, the rum's sitting on the top. The rum is sitting on the top. Rum dole with float. Can't beat it. This is the line to get on the monorail. How about that? It is. It's starting to move now. Now we're at the Grand Floridian. You know, it smells like gingerbread in here. 
obviously. So gingerbready donut. So in lieu of the monorail and the boat situation, we opted for, hey there, calling an Uber. That really is the easiest. Now you got to photobomb me. Hey, what's up? How you doing? Hello, everybody out there in non-Disneyland. <laughs> this is Randy. This is Randy. Yes. yes. Good to see you. Have a great day. You too. Thanks, Randy. We are going to uh, Uber over to the... Wilderness Lodge to get to the car. We figured that would save a lot of time and stress because it is really busy today. But we've had a fun time. We've had a fun time. Oh, we've had a blast. Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting worn out a little bit. A lot of walking. Yeah. On a bum hip. So. Yeah. So I mean, it's a. a we did the Ford Deluxe Resorts. Yeah. Which was the major thing to do. Yeah. Uh, gosh, it's they're just so lovely. It just. Yeah beautiful and decadent and everything's so pretty it's almost beyond words to describe it because i mean it's really kind of grandiose if you will yeah but um they're just so beautiful unique really. in their own each one is unique in its own way <coughs> decorated yeah, so I mean, nicely each has their own decoration design style that yeah. flair but we hope um, we hope that you guys enjoyed the video yeah, yeah we hope you do it and give us a thumbs up yeah. and, because we enjoyed making it. It was, it was a fun we afternoon. Alone. We got more coming. Yeah. I know we mentioned a couple other resorts that they're, well, they're, they're, they're high end, but they're not the deluxe resorts. Yeah. Uh, we'll get to those another day. So yeah. much for that to come out as well. Um, yeah. We'd be doing all kinds of Christmas stuff. So hey, right. with us, join us. Uh, right. Give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the you channel. Like us. Subscribe to our channel. Yep. There goes the monorail right over my head. Right over our head. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. All right, guys. Bye-bye. God bless. Bye-bye, everybody.